Part of my role as a cycle instructor is teaching how to ride. So whether you've been on a bike before, or whether you've never been on a bike, or you've maybe learnt many years ago and you're a little bit rusty, I'm going to show you a few steps today that will hopefully get you riding. First of all, you'll see that I've got a, a cycle helmet on. Um, I would always advise that you wear a cycle helmet when you're cycling to protect your head. The first thing we need to think about if we're going to be learning to ride a bike is it's a good idea to have your saddle as low down as you can to get your feet nice and flat on the floor just while you're learning. Now I'm going to show you how to get on your bike. I want you to hold your brakes to stop the bike moving. You can lean the bike towards you a little bit and then swing your right leg over and onto the saddle. So we're now ready to have a go at riding our bikes. First of all, I'll, all I want you to do is just push the bike along with your feet flat on the floor, just like this. Until you get comfortable. Once you're comfortable doing that, I want you to try and go a little bit faster with some bigger pushes, and as your bike starts to move, you will feel the balance of the bike, which is what cycling is all about. So push your bike a little bit faster. When it starts moving a little bit, try and lift your feet off the ground. We call this gliding, just like this. you go, the more the bike will hold itself up and balance you. So go a little bit faster, try and take your feet off the ground for as long as you can and just glide the bike and feel the bike balancing itself. Once you've managed to do that and you feel comfortable doing that, then we can move on to the next step. This is what we call scooting. So for this step, you will need your left pedal all the way to the bottom. Put your foot on that pedal and have your right leg behind the pedal. Now we call this scooting because it's just like being on a scooter. So all I want you to do is keep that left foot on the pedal and again push your bike along but just with your right foot pushing this time. And once you get a bit of speed going, try and lift your right foot off the ground. Just like this. The reason I want you to keep your left foot on that lower pedal is because it keeps the right pedal up in the air. So that when you're able to, each time you're scooting along, just try and lift your right foot a little bit higher off the ground each time until you've got your foot high enough that it can go flat onto the pedal. As soon as your foot hits that pedal, just push forward and then the pedals will go around and you'll be pedaling your bike. It might take you quite a long while to get to this stage. I'll just show you once more. So left foot on the bottom pedal, pushing yourself along like a scooter, and then pushing your foot on the pedal. And that is all there is to it. It might take you a little while, a little bit of practice, but if you follow those simple steps, hopefully you'll get riding your bike. <laughs>